Hey, welcome everybody. Today's video is going to be super exciting because I'm going to announce a new tool for you all developers that will help save a lot of time when generating new Laravel project. So the tool is available for free at webdematics.com and over here you can see a new link Laravel generator. Let's go to it. You need to be logged in to access this page. You can create new Laravel project from here or from navigation. Let's uh, create new project and name it so whatever name you want to give your project whatever you are building you can choose laravel 7 or 8 let's choose latest version submit it now our brand new project is created so in new project uh, we got this user model by default uh, now you can see that and from here you can create new model so your project contains several models several tables so you can create new model from here let's say for example in e-commerce we have product we can choose product and in this model we uh, have option to define the table structure for the model so from here i can define the name of name column for product table and i can choose all of the options available to us so name will be string and then description can choose like text price so you got the idea you can choose anything from here so for length you can give like for eight digit decimal number with two after uh, decimal point so you can give option here or you can choose integer so here is another option called I also need resourceful controller whenever you check this option you can get option to specify the controller name so by default uh, it will be the name of the model and controller will be automatically appended when we download the code and you can you have option to choose web or api so if you just want to generate the api controller you choose that or web and you save it so we have a new product model saved similarly you can create another model for example order I'll just give a demo order number order number we are creating the column name for the table so here is a cool part so suppose we want to have relationship between order and user and we want here user ID column and since this user ID column corresponds to user model or user table uh, we have to give this ID and now it will automatically create the belongs to relationship between order and user model you can also choose nullable or you can just delete it so grand total so if you want to grand total let's give decimal with 8 comma 2 meaning it will save the two digit after decimal and total of 8 so you can delete the column or add new similarly you can generate resourceful controller so you don't have to give like this controller here just do order and controller will be automatically appended you can generate api as well if you want and let's save it similarly you can uh, create as many model as you want here which will help us to just get an overview of what we are getting in our project what models we have we are going to generate so after you have defined all the uh, models and controllers then you can just generate and download the project which will uh, download all the codes that you have generated so I will do download and here you uh, get the instruction of how to install it just read through it and download project so whenever we do download project this zip file is just downloaded over here I will open it up and you will see a brand new Laravel project for you and in app you can see inside model we have orders product so let's open it up on VS code and see it so we have this ecommerce.zip I am extracting it first step is to just extract this zip and open it up on code all right all right so let's see what it generated for us if you go to app models and order.php 
you can see all fillable columns are populated casts also belongs to you uh, relationship is also defined product and another thing it created is inside database it generated all the factories for us inside migration we got all migration with all column defined orders for decimal we got 8 and 2 everything that we defined on graphical user interface is uh, here all code is generated for us so inside resources views it generated uh, dummy views for us right now it is not generating all scaffolding code for view file in later release i will uh, put that functionality as well so another thing it generated is tests so if you go inside tests http order controller test you get a basic test defined for us similarly for product controller as well all tests are defined how cool is that so we got model we got controller http controller order controller everything all the repetitive code is defined for us product controller all the resourceful control is defined and if we go to web.php routes is also defined yeah so these are the things that you have to repeat for each of the models in all of the projects so imagine how much time it will save for you and yeah you let me know by giving feedback from here if you just go click this and open it up i'll open it up on new tab so you it will direct you to this feedback page and here you can type your feedback and give your feedback about this project how uh, i can improve this tool and is it helpful for you and what new features you want similarly there is another uh, thing you can do you can add relation you can choose relationship type and with which model you have relationship like so so belongs to relationship is already defined and if you want has many relationships suppose uh, order has many products if you want that kind of relationship you need to have order id here order id save it and you want to make this order has many products so we are trying to make put the relationship between this these two add relation relationship type order has many product just save it so we have this relationship has many product now let's try to download the project so it will create new zip file and if we open up our models so order has many so i can see here so this relationship is defined order has many product yeah so this is these are the options available to us so hope this project will be helpful to generate another cool project for you it will save you a lot of time so with that said i will see you on another video bye